new exhibit at Purdue University Galleries illustrates an artist's battle against cancer. And this morning, gallery director Craig Martin joins us in the studio with more about this uh, presentation. Can you tell me a little bit about it? Yeah, it's the works of an artist named Mary Hamilton, who lived in New York, and uh, her husband is also an artist. But she was a uh, practicing artist who was diagnosed in 2002 uh, with cancer, and her work slowly changed over the six and a half years that she survived the experience. Uh, and th it's just emblematic. of It shows, you know, the impact on her and life and her work, but it's very hopeful and very you know, inspirational to see. And uh, if someone wants to attend, um, it's run, it starts on the 26th, that's when mm -hmm. it opens. Um, but where is it located? And it's in the Stewart Center Gallery on campus, uh, adjacent to Fowler Hall. And there's a, an opening reception on Thursday next week uh, where her husband will speak about her life and her work, and then there'll be a reception following. Okay. And can we talk a little bit about some of the, some of the images, some of the pieces mm -hmm. that she created? Her work is primarily abstract. It was beforehand. And slowly over time, uh, you can see she started to introduce imagery of uh, here woodpeckers, but endangered animals, endangered birds, or extinct animals, as well as PET scans, body scans of herself uh, during the treatment process, and still incorporated them in somewhat an abstract way in some uh, images more than others. And uh, it just became a little more personalized and a little bit more about mortality and you know, sort of the fragility of life. Mm -hmm. And you said her husband um, will be speaking about her life and work, um, mm -hmm. and this is part of a series. Um, and yeah. you, can you tell us a little bit about the series? Purdue's Oncology Science Centers, uh, sponsors with liberal arts on campus, uh, sponsors a cancer culture and community activity every year. And uh, last, last year they brought in a playwright, this year they're bringing in a poet. Each of them and all of these experiences are tied to the arts and sort of the aesthetic response to, uh, to you know, people suffering and living with cancer. So mm -hmm. it's sort of a different take. Other than a scientific view, it's more of an aesthetic and cultural look at, at uh, how we deal with that experience. It looks fascinating. Well, if anyone wants to attend, the opening reception is on Thursday, the 29th, mm -hmm. at the Purdue University Galleries. Yeah. Thanks for coming in. It looks sure, like a really interesting uh, artwork. Thank you. Thank very you. Much. Well, coming